Now, one of the things uh, I always tell you is, is when we ask the wrong question, we always get the wrong answer. By getting the wrong answer, I'm not saying it's the incorrect answer. I'm saying it's the wrong answer. It is the wrong answer that we need to meet the real need. The answer is not going to give us an unshakable security. It's going to give us an intellectual security. And so, so if I answer the question, yes, I believe in what I'd always say, I might get intellectual security, but I got news for you, there's always going to be something missing. And so I have to look at the scripture that says, well, well, wait a minute, maybe there's another question that I have to ask. And at the end of my sermon that day, one of the questions I ask is this, I said, so maybe the real question you need to ask is not once saved, always saved. Maybe the real question you need to ask is, do I value my salvation enough to want to live a godly life? Do I value my influence on the world around me in a way that says I am going to live a godly life? Do I know and value what Jesus did for me on the cross and in the grave and through the resurrection? Do I value that enough that I, that I love him deeply enough to be faithful to him? And I don't really care if the doc, I don't even care if one saved or always saved is true or not true. What I care about is I love my Savior who paid this incredible uh, price for me. 